Now, are you ready to listen? Where's Nikki? Personally, before this, I was bored. How's your dad? Going to fight another day? You? Term lecture? Have to start a political awareness pamphlet? Hypocrisy is a beautiful thing. I myself being its biggest subscriber. I was the leading publisher of protest propaganda on campus. I gave plenty to shout about. This is about the protests? None of my concern. That is. Expulsion. I sold got sold out. Two years probation, three months house arrest. What am I supposed to do now? Bored, tired, house arrested. I think I'm being stalked. You're a young white male living in the crime capital of the world. You're being paranoid. Because I'm being watched. By who? At first I thought it was the government. Jesus, dude. But now I think it's nationalists. I want you to write for the nationalist party. There are always going to be sides. The problem with always doing what someone else wants you to do? You don't have a choice. You will help us, or everyone you love, including yourself, will get hurt. This eventually sides are going to cross, and you're gonna have to make a decision. What are you doing? David, there's something we need to talk about. I know about your plan. You think you figured it out? Boom. <laughs> You made some bad choices, son. I saw someone killed, and I can't talk to anybody about just it. Just remember that I'm the firing squad. And behind closed doors, I do what's necessary to maintain. And when that time comes, do you really want to be standing with them? That's where you put me. Then you better convince me who side you're on. In dealing with a life and death decision, the only question is... David, this is serious. I don't know how much help I can be in any of this. Is it yours to make? I think I know what I have to do. 